Daniel. We should eat it. Come check this out. What? Delicious little hands. What? Be quiet. One for each of us. What's up guys and welcome to Life is Strange 2. Now having played Life is Strange and its prequel Life is Strange Before the Storm on the channel, I can say that I'm a fan of the series, but I don't know where this is gonna go and I'm kinda worried, honestly, because Life is Strange was amazing. It was unlike anything I had played before, but then the prequel was kinda boring. I wasn't all that impressed, you know, the gameplay was a little hit or miss, and it, it didn't have anything supernatural in it, it was fan service. You know, it was just there for people who enjoyed the first game and wanted to learn more about the story, and that's perfectly fine, but now I'm really curious, is this going to be more of that, or is it going to be something else? And all I really know right now is in the email that the developers sent me this game in, it said that this is a direct sequel to Life is Strange, but with different characters. So there's no Max, no Chloe, or anything like that. It's two boys who are coping with the aftermath of the storm. Now, whether or not that's gonna hold up to the first game, I don't really know, but I'm curious to find out. October 28th, 2016. I don't remember when the first one took place. Yeah, the Crumpet Shop. You'll find a whole lot of crime there. K. Matthews. Oh, shit. The Officer Matthews. I've got a 1010 in progress. 1452 Lewis Avenue. I'm gonna need backup. Okay. We might have some supernatural in this game. We're off to a good start. What's a 1010? I might need to look that up. Okay, update time. You heard back from Jen yet? Um, no. I'm sure she'll reply at some point. Let me take a look at the situation. Hey, Jen, you going to the party tonight? Dude, we talked about this. Could you have any less game? <sighs> I'm no good at this. Ooh, how about... Yo, Jen, see you at the party. Let me know if I should bring handcuffs. <laughs> oh my god, you thirsty bitch. Here, let Lila the Love Witch work her magic. Are you 12? Okay, don't make me sound like a loser. I said matchmaker, not miracle worker. Hey, hold on. Let me check it before you send. Too late. You just got off the school bus. Would be awesome to see you there. What? I could have texted that. It's a good start. She'll text back, you'll see. You know, I don't even know if I want to go tonight. Oh, please. It's gonna be fun. You hate every party. Oh, because 
They're all the same. Too many people, too fucking loud, everybody's wasted. Yes, Sean, you just described a party. Sean, well, okay. The suspense is killing me. It's dad, wants to know if I'm coming home after school. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not a 10 year old. <laughs> he just cares about you, Sean. That's so two anyway, years ago. You should be happy your dad's looking out for you. Oh, it's Jen saying she can't wait to see us at the party. What? Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Told you I would work my matchmaker magic. Hmm. So, so what should I wear tonight? A condom. Oh, ha ha. Paying plenty of attention in sex ed class, I see. Can we get an age check on them hey, before I make any comments? Back from the loony bin? Shut the fuck up, dickhead. Damn, your neighbor's an asshole. Yep. Always true to himself. Man, we need to find a couch for your yard one day. Ooh, careful. Last time my dad almost busted me out here. Because you were alone? Your dad wouldn't bust me. He loves me. So, you want to hit or not? I'm starting to think they're not 12. They might be like late high schoolers, but they're very polished and plastic, so they look really young. Uh, do I want to take one and get in trouble with my dad? Potentially? Uh, you know what? I, I'm gonna go out and say, uh, does smokers or jokers? Mm. Nah, maybe at the party. Track stars aren't supposed to smoke, you know? Yeah, sure. I'll remember this when you're begging for a spliff tonight. Speaking of weed, I got that covered tonight. What else do we need? Eric said his parents don't leave shit at the cabin, so we better make an official party list. Hey, whoa, what the hell are don't you doing? Don't move. You're my human post-it note. That's it rated so on me so my dad can see money it. Money for supplies, munchies, chips and dip, soda, etc. Uh, this better wash off. And of course, we must not forget the booze. I can probably snag a six-pack from Dad if he's got enough. Hey, did you ever think of maybe just sending a text instead? Hmm. All oh, right, blankets. It's gonna get so chilly tonight. You and Jen are gonna need something to snuggle under. Oh, one last thing. C O N D O. Oh, stop! You're out of room, punk. Condo is good. I need as many condos as I can get my hand on. Is that a penis? Is this how you see a penis? Damn, you should try and actually see one for real. You don't want to go down that road, dude. My chances of scoring tonight are probably ten times yours. <laughs> well, yeah, you're a girl. You literally just have to say, do you want to toss it in me? And the answer is going to be yes. I want to hate them, but I'll miss them. So much if I move somewhere else. You know, planes are everywhere, right? So fast. I get so emo sometimes, wondering what will happen to us once we graduate. Will you still be my BFF? Will shit ever get better than 1452 Lame Avenue? Uh, I guess I'll be nice. Yeah, man. Friends forever. Yeah, but what happens if we go to different colleges? Or you get sick of me. Whatever. Uh, you heard of the internet? <laughs> no way distance can tear us apart. We're freaking fighters. Yeah, you're right. Best freaking fighters forever. They're gonna bang before the end of this. Okay, I'm calling it right now. I gotta pick out my outfit for tonight. Skype me later when you're ready. Hugs. Talk to you soon. Hello, Friday night.
Interesting. This isn't how I expected it to start. Hey, perfect timing. Just the sun I wanted to see. Oh, sure. I'm a little busy. Did you see Lila? She said we can go to the movies next week. She said... Dude, bug her, not me. You're not exactly her type. You're lucky she puts up with you. Ugh, oh, jeez. Thanks, Pop. I feel really supported right now. You're welcome. And now we need an objective judge. That would be you. <gasps> really? Hey, no shh, fair. Shh, shh. Court is in session. Judge Diaz presiding over the case of the last Choco Crisp. I... I have to go, uh, get ready for a party and stuff. So... Well, if you want to attend to a party and stuff, you have to earn it, Your Honor. Oh, shit. Hey, he swore. Yes, I heard Tattletale. Mm. Please, Judge Diaz, be an example to the court and society. Then you can go hook up or chill or whatever. Now, who deserves to eat this final choco crisp? Your adorable little brother who eats about 10 bags a week, or your poor, suffering father who slaves over a hot engine to provide his family with a home and a garage? Me, me, me. Come on, Judge. Shh, 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 shh. Let him decide. Judge, the verdict, please. Oh, these freaking games, man. You know that this is like the least important decision that you're ever going to make. And yet here I am wondering, like, if I choose the kid, is, is dad going to die? Here's what I'm thinking. I know that I'm going to be spending the majority of this game with my little brother, and I don't know what's going to happen to dad. Maybe we run away. Maybe he dies. Maybe he's a figment of my imagination. I really have no idea. So I should probably give it to him, but I think I'm just gonna let them split it. You're both guilty of wasting my time. Case closed. What? No fair. Dad. That's not Dad, really what I meant. This. My own flesh and blood tosses me under the bus. I you guess you suck. both die. Okay, back to work. I hear an engine calling my name. And you better play nice together, like you always do. Sorry, Dad, yeah. I tried to give you half. I have to work in my room, too. Yeah? Don't hurry back. I gotta go dress up in condoms and stuff with whatever. Ooh, empty wrapper. <sighs> okay. Let's get this party list started. Mind if I do? It's good to be the judge. <laughs> you see, if I get caught having taken the beer, Maybe Dad would be okay with it because I gave him the candy? Probably not. I don't think that would have actually done anything. Angry note. That's right. Mr. Get Diaz, your property line overhangs on mine and your children are loud and won't stay on their side. I've told you many times to build a legal proper fence, no higher than six feet according to Seattle Land Use Code, between our two properties and you have not done it yet. I know my rights as a U.S. citizen, maybe you don't, and I expect you to also follow the rules. If you do not build a proper fence, then I might take you to small claims court for damages. Your neighbor, Scott Von Foster, I'm guessing that's a dad of dickweed next door. That makes a whole lot of sense. I'll just say right now, the graphics look quite a bit better in this game, and they have school bags. Better pack for the party. Okay. Oh, this is my inventory. Okay, we have uh, a lot of garbage. Yep. Yep. That. Oh, I got like three dollars in my wallet and uh, a whole lot of crap. Well then. And lo and behold, I'm 16 years old. So I was close. Step one, acquire food and beer. Which should be in the fridge, I would assume. Uh, we get soda. We have beer. Ted doesn't drink that much. Does he keep track? There's only four beers here. And it's in the center of the fridge. I get the feeling he might... Uh, screw it. That'll do. Bet there's gonna be a keg at the cabin. We took them all. You didn't take one. You, you didn't siphon off some. You, you literally took them all. Okay, you know what? You're you're the dead man. 
It's even giving me the option to switch to the soda. If I don't want to make this bad decision, I can take the soda. It's not too late. I'm, I'm going to take the beer. I'm perfectly happy with the beer. Thank you very much. Now, Cross we also need food. Down. Food to go. Right. Food and dicks. Uh, what is that? Talk smoothie. Dad tries so hard to get on a healthy diet. I can't wait for him to be on Instagram. Good for him. Oh, I need cash. Use that. Real funny, Dad. <laughs> drug money. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, do I steal Dad's drug money? Yeah, I think I do. Uh, no harm. I need money. I'll pay this back before next week's pizza night. Oh. Pizza night money. Well then. I guess we're gonna go pizza list. I can even put back the ten dollars. I really don't like the fact that it, it lets you go back on your decisions. Make me commit. Corn syrup. No, I'm good. I don't need to look at corn syrup. I need food. Where where would the munchies be? Here we go. Cabinet. Hmm. We can take cookies. Halloween candy. Chips. Uh I think the lady. What was her name? I think the lady wrote chips on my hand, so let's take those. I hope there's also, like, real food at this party. I don't think I want cookies or Halloween candy. Yeah, take the Halloween candy. Little brother might be upset. There's a pretty big, uh, yeah, don't eat for Halloween with, with a giant <laughs> mark on it. And cookies. Yeah, I think I'm good. Making good, wholesome decisions here. Uh... Or anything else that I need? There's a picture here. I look at the picture. Oh, I got a new message from uh, Lila. That was her name. You ready for the party yet? Answer or I'll take your hot dad. Ooh, I, I don't know how to answer, so I, I think I'm good. Thank you. I was going to look at this picture of my family. <laughs> Daniel kept saying, I'm freezing. But we couldn't get him off the skis. Daniel. Sean and Daniel. And Poppy. Okay. We got everything under control here. That's the bear's lair. Daniel's room. Okay. This is my room. Let's go in here. I don't know if there's anything else I need to get. Was she being sarcastic about the condoms? Because those would probably be important. Uh, let's take a look around. I have another message. Yo, Diaz, I hear you're gonna tap Murphy's ass. Herv, I, I don't even know who you are. You, you don't even have a face in my phone, and you're writing in all caps, so I, I think I'm just gonna ignore you like the rest of the internet asshole. would. Yeah, asshole is right. Uh, is there anything I can get in here, cabinet? That would be a place where you would hide. Uh, weed pipe? We'll take that. Lila provides the weed tonight. Okay. I be ready. Get a flyer. Sophomore, no more. Must be the party that we're going to. Interesting. Uh, do I have everything? Nightstand. Probably hide something in here, wouldn't I? Nope. I came looking for condoms, and I found my action figures. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Maybe. Oh, we found. There it is. Okay, we're good. The got these for free during sex ed last year. Good. You never know. There's no shame. <sighs> Bring him anyway. Not sure Daniel was ready to be an uncle yet. Yeah, exactly. Dad wants me to keep this junk as backup. Right. Does it hurt? I think that's our whole list. Right? Do we have everything? I still need to find a blanket, and apparently my bed blankets weren't good enough. So maybe there's some blankets down here. Light switch. Ooh. Okay. All right, Dad. Where do you put the blankets? Now we're talking. Keep anything hidden over here, Dad? We got some ski stuff, Christmas decorations, old boxes, blankets. Thank you. I'm sure Dad won't miss one blanket for the night. What's a few jizz stains between family? Right? I uh, no, no, it's me, Daniel. It's me, Daniel. Cool. Can you tell your big brother he's grounded tonight when you see him? Hey, 
Since you're creeping around up there, can you pass me the wrench in the top red drawer over there? Top red sure. drawer. Can do. Okay. Um, there's no wrench here. Ah, shoot. Must be somewhere else then. Take a look around. I know I left it nearby. It's a 16 millimeter reversible flex wrench. Jeez. Oh, Is it in your hand? For tonight. So, yeah. Hold on. Uh. Sam came by the garage today. Told me to tell you hi for him. How's his leg? Well, you know, old fossils like us don't heal the way you do. Uh, remind me never to get old. Hey, it beats the alternative. Isn't that true? This one looks reversible. I don't know why I just shoved it in my back pocket like I'm trying to steal it, but maybe this will please Papa? Hey, I got it. I think. Nah. I need one with the black switch on it so I can change its direction. Black switch changes direction. Okay, hey, Smokey. Did you get your English midterm back? Uh, yeah. I got a B. A B? But you were so confident about the essay you wrote. Yeah, I think Mrs. Callow is just prejudiced against Vonnegut. But Slaughterhouse-Five is amazing. Hey, you don't got to tell me. Tell her. Next parent-teacher meeting? <laughs> She's getting a piece of my mind. Yeah, she should. English is bullshit. Prejudiced against Vonnegut. <sighs> hey, seriously. What's taking you so long? I'm working hey, on it, okay? You're talking. I'm not a mechanic. Come on. Bring me anything, really. I'm, I'll tell you if it's the right one. I'm pretty sure it's right here in front of me. I, I just, I wanted to listen to what you have to say. And like I was saying, English is bullshit. It's all subjective. The same essay you get a 60 or an 85. It just depends how the teacher's feeling that day. There we go. I'm going to steal this one. I think this one has a little black switch on it. Maybe. Possibly. Kind of hard to tell. Here you go. Better? Hmm. Wrong size. I need a 16 millimeter. I'm just gonna bring you everything. In reality, I could probably look at them first, but is that it? I'd rather just do this. Yes, this is it. Took your time about it, but you did it. Yay, go team. I'll make a grease monkey out of you. Yeah, Can I have yeah. some money? All right, just let me tighten this. So, finally decided to come and join your old man under the hood, huh? <laughs> yeah, um, sure. I know it's not your thing, but you gotta learn a trade. Art, athletics, engineering, I don't care. As long as you put your heart into it. What's the point, or I'm trying? Uh, I'm trying. I'm trying. I just don't know what direction to go. You're only 16 years old. You've got time to figure it out. Trust me, it took me a while, too. And you happy with it? I mean, your job? Living here? Of course I am. We're doing great. Maybe one day when I retire, I'll go back to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. But until then... Ugh, I've heard this one before. Hmm. I don't even know why I'm fixing you a sweet car for graduation. Don't mind if I do. Uh, you don't have to, or it's wicked. Ugh, come on. It's wicked. I'm just not used to driving. You better get used to it, or you'll be taking your date to prom on the number 30 bus. Like I'm going on tons of dates. Not when Daniel's cock-blocking me the whole time. He's nine. He doesn't <laughs> even know what cock-blocking is. He looks up to you, Sean. Try and help him. It's what family is for. Things are kind of scary out there in this country right now. Yeah. Oh, um... By the way... Ha! I was wondering how long it'd take. Money! You need money for the party tonight, right? <sighs> Don't uh, worry, I already have beer and condoms! Just be honest with me. No bullshit. Are you using this money to buy alcohol? Weed? No, I stole yours. Uh, just Halloween stuff. Yeah, right? Just Halloween stuff? Lila's bringing the weed, and I already stole booze. So, I would assume it's Halloween stuff. This seems truthful. Uh, come on. I, I wouldn't spend money on booze. I'd steal it. We just want to get some... Uh, some Halloween crap and stuff. Well, 
Don't be too convincing. You definitely don't need the forty dollars I was going to give you. Twenty bucks? Ah. Uh. That's it. You can buy a lot of Halloween crap and stuff for twenty bucks, unless you're lying your ass off. Remember, no eating candy and driving. You got it? Tell Lila too. You hear me? Yes, sir. If I told him I was gonna get booze and weed, Just would he have given care. me more? That's all I'm asking for, okay? I know what kind of crazy shit kids can get into. Uh, did you party a lot or don't? Yeah, did you party a lot? When you were my age. Did you party a lot? <laughs> Sorry. What happens in Mexico stays in Mexico. Damn it. Get out of here before I change my mind about that cash. And keep an eye on Daniel while you're home. Would you? <laughs> all right. Thanks, Dad. Hey, hey, hey. Not so fast, Shawnee boy. Don't you think your papito deserves a hug? Uh, yeah, fine. Ugh. Okay, have fun. But not too much. I won't. Promise. Bye. Love ya. I love you too, hijo. Okay. I bet Dad had a pretty wild teenagehood. Even though he won't tell. That went well. Looks like I got everything. Better pack it all up. Yeah, so we got 20 bucks. I, I still don't know if I could have gotten that whole 40 if he was just teasing me. But we also stole $10 from the drug money. So technically we're up, what, uh, $33.20. You can get a, a whole lot of Halloween stuff for that much. I could just leave, and I probably should just leave, but I told Dad that I would check on Daniel, keep an eye on him and stuff. Or not. Dude, come on, open up. Why? Because. Okay, okay. Oh, because, I see. What are you doing in there, Dr. Frankenstein? You ate my Choco Crisp. Oh, don't be pissed. You always see the whole box. What's with the scissors? You'll see, but not now. So don't come in. Uh, okay. Okay, fine. Don't tell me. After all, I'm only your big brother. Who looks after you and takes care of you. <sighs> Stop it. All I can say is, watch out for my costume in three days. Halloween this stuff Halloween figured. This going to be awesome. Are you going to the party tonight at Eric's house? Will Lila be there? Yes, 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 and no. You can't go. Teenagers only. I bet Lila would let me go. She's way nicer to me than you. You're nine. Did she ask about me? Uh, what? Well, no. <sighs> I'm sorry, dude. She's cheating on you. Shut up. I don't even care if I can't go. Because... Because... I have secret stuff to do. Alone. Of course you do. That was a locking noise, wasn't it? It was always up to something. Wonder what's next. Hmm. Interesting. Secret things. So he's got a bit of a crush on Lila, and I don't. Even though, like I said... I still get the feeling that we're gonna bang. It's not gonna work out with Jen. Just gonna call okay. it right now. Gotta go back to the living room and load the backpack. Thank you, Sean, for cluing us all in there. I wonder where Mom is in this whole picture. Finally, ready to go. Time to Skype Lila on my laptop. That would be in my room. See, you don't even need to say that out loud. Call Lila. Oh, lover boy. Just give me a minute. Gee, where did I put the... Mm, hold on. Okay, hi. Did you get everything on your hand list? It's all in my backpack, yeah. Dad hooked me up with some cash, so 
We're set for the night, in case we need anything else. Or if you and Jen need anything else, ooh la la. <sighs> okay, serious talk. What are you gonna say to Jen tonight? I don't know, whatever. Do I need to practice? <sighs> I've seen you in action. Yes, you're totally into her, right? You gotta be aloof, and I don't know, whatever, is like the most aloof you can be. That's perfect. Uh, she's super cool, or so what? Uh, so, hmm. I'm honestly wondering if I can get with Lila. Maybe we'll just go, so what? So what? I don't have any game. These are uncharted territories for me. You're super cute. Just be yourself. That's why she's Sean. into you. Sean, I'm done, look. I made zombie blood. It's um, corn syrup and food coloring. Wow, hey, how long did that work? Oh yeah, hi. Get out of my room, Daniel. I was just. Come on, man. Just. The, just bugging the uh, shit out of what? me again after I told you to knock. Uh, yeah, what? I know. I shouldn't be so anyway, hard on him. He is nine. Asshole. What's your problem? But I want to see zombie blood if you don't. Oh really? Uh, no, he's not always cute. He's not always cute. You would sound like me too if you lived with him. Anyway. You wouldn't be so uptight if you got laid. And so help me with that. The night. Don't jinx me. Jinx? I'm your lucky charm, bitch. <laughs> okay. So when are you coming over? I just have to hit up the momster for the car keys and hope she doesn't make me lie too much about the party. I'm already in trouble from last time. This time, don't get caught. Oh shit. Jen just posted her outfit for tonight. What? On her wall. You should check it out. It might get your attention. Oh, it'll get something to attention. Uh, check the page. Whoa. Her hair. Whoa, indeed. I told you she was super into you, man. What's her profile picture got to do with me? Huh. You will see. Uh, I don't get it do i comment oh gee, i don't want to comment lol but i also don't want to comment a heart can i just comment something appropriate come on game i'm in my 20s man i haven't done this in a long time i don't really need to be questioning whether or not a heart is too far and not commenting isn't far enough i'm not gonna comment i'm not gonna leave any comments i'll be surprised no when i see reaction, her no like no nothing i didn't have that Me, option i don't appear like a stalker or something <laughs> Okay, okay. Touche. Why do you just sit there quietly? <sighs> Why is Derek Anderson all over Jen's profile? <sighs> He's an asshole. Better be nice. They're like best friends, stalker. Really? Oh. In that case, I'll spare him. <laughs> Dude, she already likes you. Don't blow Hold on, okay? Oh, uh, what now? Outside. What do you mean? I gotta bring hey. the neighbor to Pound Town. Hold on. Look at my shirt, asshole. What's the big deal? It's Halloween. Why would you do that? Don't ever touch my brother. You hear me, Brett? Fuck you, Diaz. He got his fake blood shit all over my shirt. Look. I told you, it was an accident. You better leave us alone. Oh, yeah. Go hide in your dad's garage. Pussies. You think you own the block? Ooh, now we get to make a choice. Question Daniel or confront Brett. I am curious. That, that has a whole lot of handprints to be an accident and, uh, oh man. I, I don't know. Like I should just stand up for my brother no matter what. But I also am kind of worried that my neighbors might go ballistic and do something to my dad. Uh. Oh crap, this seems like one of those big decisions. I don't believe Daniel. I don't think this was an accident. But at the same time, all of the dialogue that we've gotten so far in this game is, you know, family first, and I'm your big brother, and I watch out for you, and all that stuff, and this guy's a dickhole. So let's just treat him like a dickhole. Dude, step back. He didn't mean it. He's a fucking kid. He's a fucking retard. What? What did you just say? You heard me, bitch. Don't ever touch him again or what you're gonna get your daddy hey asshole i don't need him to protect me from you oh you, you want to go oh yeah motherfucker 
Then go back to your own country. Whoa! There we go. Sean, you hit him. Yeah, sure did. Get inside now. That's not fake blood. You dead meat, bitch. Oh yeah. Come on, give me some control. Losers. What's going on? me. Daniel, get over here. Sean. Hurt? Okay. Okay, step away. Now. Calm down, officer. Shut up. And step back. What did he just fall on? Oh. On the ground. They think that the now. blood is real. Hey, wait. This guy was he started beating me. up my little on the brother. Ground. Now. Hands behind your Sean. head. Sean. This is fucking bullshit. Oh, no. Sean. What's happening? Oh, no. We didn't do Sean, anything. Sean, be quiet. I swear. I'm, I'm, sure. Sure. Listen. Oh, I'm sorry, Dad. Daddy, be quiet. Go home. They're good kids, I'm don't sure. Move. I'm sure they didn't do I anything. Don't move. They didn't Daddy, do anything. It's gonna be all right. On the ground. Ah! Holy crap. some supernatural for you. I, I, I've always said it. I hate how this game gives you huge decisions and then in all likelihood There's no way that I was coming out of that with my dad Right like I, this was gonna be how the game was gonna progress no matter what it might have happened differently But we saw from the beginning right they started with that little scene, but it still makes you feel like crap. <laughs> oh my god Near Mount Rainer, Washington, two days later. Something tells me I never got to that party. No, man. We can't stop here. We gotta keep going. No pouting, okay? Come on. But... But... My feet really hurt. These shoes suck. And we've been walking for four days. What? Only two. Don't even try that shit. And my back hurts from sleeping under that stupid bridge. Yeah, so does mine. I was there too. Just knock it off. I hate it when you act like this. This is how people camp in the woods. It's not like being being at home or 
or in your room. This is a, a real adventure, right? So, come on, let's hit the trail. Seriously. Where's Dad? Daniel, come on. We gotta go. Why isn't Dad with us, Sean? Doesn't he want to go camping too? Yes, but I told you that he can't. I told you, okay? Okay, but I'm so sick of walking. I just wish I was back in my room. I know, I know. Hey, at least we don't have to go to school on Monday, right? Yeah. Look, um, everybody's gonna be so stoked when they find out how far you walked. Really? Really? I bet Dad would be too. Do you think we walked, like, maybe a hundred miles? Probably two hundred. Feels like it. Ooh, awesome possum. But next time, Dad better get me a good pair of shoes, like yours. Dude, <laughs> Bigfoot doesn't need good shoes. I'd rather be a wolf. Ow! How many wolves wear shoes? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that works. Just work on that how. Hey, you know what? Let's see if you can walk the whole way without complaining once. Huh? Uh, like, you don't whine too? I don't whine. I... I... Tag your ass and no, run! You're right! No way! Not fair! Whatever. Okay. I'm a zombie, and I'm gonna eat you! Well, I can safely say that this is not how I expected the game to begin, but it's what I hoped for. This is exactly like the first game. It's already got me incredibly interested. You're not allowed to say that, ever again. Yes, I don't even sir. know where we're going. You'll be the first one to know when we get there, okay? I'm tired and hungry too. Wish I had brought more Listen, than chips. This looks like a perfect place to camp out. But I am happy I stole that I pizza bet money. I'm not the first people to stay the night. It's creepy. There's nobody out here. 
We didn't even see any cars. We're gonna camp here. I'll look out for you. Where did we want to camp? It's kind of the side of the road. Maybe there's something up ahead? Seeing more signs, can I... Yeah, I'm gonna run. I should oh, be going first. Look. Interesting. Found a car, and... Man. Well, that it's is... so dirty. Hey. A car out here? Hope the driver um, isn't around watching us. I see something. Like what? What is that? It's a Choco Bar. It's a Choco Chris Bar. I see it right there. Interaction with Daniel is available. Oh. What do you find? Check it out. There's a chunky Choco Chris Bar on the dashboard. Yeah, I see it. You know I love Choco Chris Bars. I haven't had one in a million years. Yeah, right. More like two days ago. Come on. Can we please, please, please get Steal one it? We stop next, please? Oh. Let's take this one or I promise. Hmm. Uh, you know what? Let's just try to take this one. It's, it's not that big of a deal. Let's take this one. Nobody's going to miss one single Choco Chris bar. Really? I, I like the little wolves. This is for a good cause. For loading. Probably should have checked to see oh, if anybody uh, was watching almost. over there. I got it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Boom. Choco Crisp is ours. Now we have dessert. Come on. Let's beat it. Okay. Nobody seems to have spotted us. Therefore, it's the perfect crime. Hello, map. Welcome Don't mind if I do. Washington. Um, over there on the road. So we follow this path, we'll find some campgrounds to the left, and if we go right, Trotsbing Trail will bring us to a loop, and then Black Bear Forest. Kind of like the poster says. <sighs> I don't know, I guess they missed that car. What if the owners come after us for the Choco Chris? And they're hunters! You're too little to hunt. We're cool. Like I said, perfect crime. We haven't been spotted. There's also a warning here we should probably read. There must have been a big ass storm. Ooh, landslide. Doesn't sound good. Should be fine. Yeah, I mean, just keep an eye out for any damaged trails. Trailblaze. What's this? Daniel! Check out this mark on the tree. What is that? Graffiti? Not exactly. It's called a trailblaze, and people used to put them up to give directions. Oh! Like GPS? So people don't get lost. <laughs> yeah, sure. Just slightly more ancient. Awesome! Let's follow it. I guess. I thought we were just gonna camp here and then oh, keep Dad, walking. Uh... Stop thinking about that. Sign over here. Sean, look. Hold like on. Like gonna pay in the middle of nowhere. Oh, yeah. Ooh! There Sean, might be money look. in this. What? What? Hold! Shush! 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 What? What do you want? Roadkill. Oh. Oh no! Raccoon! Should we eat it? Come on, Daniel. We can eat its little hands. It. Or not. It's nope, not nobody fair. would judge us. No. No, it's not, Daniel. I'm thinking we break open the box and steal the money. Damn. This is gonna be a bitch. Too quiet. No, I think it's just quiet enough. Hey, Rock, how you doing? Fuck it. Perfect crime. Uh, Sean, what are you doing? Stealing. Just taking a little peek inside. But, but are we allowed to? No, it's stealing it's round two. The, the woods. Nobody cares. You weren't asking questions when it was a chocolate bar. Ah, uh, shit. Don't it? worry, it's empty. It looked like literal poop in there. All right, well, it was a good try. Hey, I thought we were going to camp. Sean? How? No reception in this shithole. Did 
time on, to go camping. The sun is going down. Yeah, it's getting kind of dark. Ooh, restroom. Don't mind if I do. Hygiene sign. Man, people don't even read the signs. Please respect the park and clean up area. Okay, good to know. So, uh, do you need to go to the bathroom? We're walking okay, around in a giant bathroom. You have to use the bathroom? No. It smells real bad. No shit. Seriously? You better go now. I don't have to go. Jeez. Can I just pee on a tree? Um, I mean... There are bears. Yeah, there are bears. As long as you don't mind the poison ivy on your balls. Uh... Well... Maybe I'll go. But don't let me get stuck in there. Don't worry. I'll call the forest plumbers if you fall in. Too many bear warnings to let him wander around. You hear that? So gross. I don't think that was a tinkle. Worse than the ones at school. <laughs> Especially after you use it. Heard like whoa. Maybe it's just the woods creaking. It sounded like a large clump. I don't think bears make that noise either. But uh, who cares? We're we're super far away from. Look how big these trees are. Bear Ridge. Uh, that's only because they need the sun. Besides, they'll protect us from the rain. What if they don't? What if they uh, attack us? Aren't you, Mr. Minecraft? It's like Lord of the Rings. Hey, you watched Lord of the Rings with Dad like a hundred times. Here's a chance to go on a real adventure with me. And the trees so were like cool. Frodo? And you're Sam? Uh Well, I was thinking more like Aragorn. You know, brave, strong, good looking. <laughs> yeah, not no even way, Sam wants to be Sam. You're Sam. Ah, oh, damn it. Sam. Dad always knew exactly where to go. Find a cave, so we can hide he was a living horse. compass. <sighs> okay, I've been listening okay. to you. Sam I am. After you, Master Daniel. Directions. This seems Where important. Are we going? Man, what are we doing out here? Hmm. Hmm. The river must be a bit further. Yeah, we could go Let's to the river, but we could go to the we picnic must be area. So far from our house. Yeah, Whoa. you were there when we did the walking. That place is huge. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Kind of hoping we can find some food hey, here. Sean, what? I found berries. No, don't, don't eat berries. Please, one, please. No, stupid child. No, no, uh, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, I'm coming. Let me take a look. Let me look, let me look at these. I don't have much. Uh, this is better than nothing. Check them, I'll check them. Oh, why would I eat them? I thought you'd check like look, not check like eat. They're okay. Oh. Go ahead. I don't think that's I how that works. The truth now. That these are poop berries, we're all gonna have vicious plant diarrhea. Oh well, in for a penny, in for a pound. This this seems like a mistake. I mean, it, it's probably good, right? Yeah, there we go. We did a thing. You happy? I'm I'm totally scavenging, supplying good things. Watch, we're gonna find like a three course meal over here. Speaking of three course meal, hello, little man. Would you mind getting in my stomach, please? Hey, 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 get back here. Get back here. Ooh, scratchings. Like, bear scratchings? Press Q to look for Daniel around you. Why? Are you gonna leave? Let's not go anywhere. Yeah, I got my eye on you, shithead. Somebody messed up this tree. Yeah, like Yogi. Shit, those are bear claws. Sure are. I'm not gonna tell Daniel. <laughs> I guess that's for the best. Listen, I can find berries. I can't fight a bear. I'll leave that to the zombies. Interesting. Uh, this cat is food? We're not that desperate yet. I'd still take it. Cat food's better than nothing. People write some stupid shit sometimes. <laughs> nothing like the perfect penis. Uh, anything worth eating over here? Come on, Sean Wise. Napkins. We must explore. Milk. Can we get forest milk. 
No. Hmm. More berries. Uh, I should probably not eat I these. No, you didn't. I did. Uh. It's the I wind, right? One, no. Uh. No. No. Uh. I. I can't. I can't stop him. I mean. Let me. Uh. I don't know what. What? No. 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 Not these ones. Not these ones. Come on. I'm starving. One me, won't hurt. Yeah, it could. I mean, you look. gotta listen to me. Look. Fucking cell phone. I what? Could only Google those. Oh. Fucking cell phone. I could only Google those. I'm not gonna risk it. I've I've already risked it. <laughs> There's more berries back there. The regular ones, okay? You don't need those ones. Uh, we got the wild animals. There are fish Picnic here. And hiking site. We could get some fish. Well. I bet nobody comes out here to picnic anymore. Well, that's good for us. No camping? Uh-oh. Don't worry. Nobody's gonna find us out here. Do not feed or disturb the animals? What? Yeah, we're just gonna eat them. What Don't worry about it. What kind of animals? Like bears? Or coyotes? Or... More like squirrels and rabbits. Anything with claws and fangs. Uh. More like squirrels, rabbits, critters. There's literally one behind Just me. Don't bug them, and they won't bug us. They're way more scared of us than we are of them. Unless they're angry or hungry. Okay, come on. Don't freak yourself out. Let's go. I'm hiding the fact that there are bears out here, and I'm kind of curious if I should just be telling him that he might actually be, you know, fearful, a little bit more cautious. Now we know what not to do, right? I guess. I don't like it here. Yeah, me neither. How about we go sit on a bench with a squirrel? Or not. I'm so tired. Feels like we're walking nowhere. Yeah, what's the plan? How am I supposed to take care of us out here? I don't even know what happened back there. To that cop. Or Daniel. Yeah, Daniel just kind of exploded. Whoa. Look at that. Yeah. So cool. Never seen you get so jacked up over a nice view before. So? I've never seen anything like this. Never, ever! Yeah. I guess you haven't. I remember when... Dad... I wish Dad was here with us. Well, thanks. Not cooling off anymore? Yes, you're super cool. But... I just wish the family was together, at home. It'll be cool to watch a movie and get a pizza and eat ice Dude, cream. Dude, stop. I stole the I pizza you money. Keep going. We'll see that later. Right now, it's just you and me, okay? Yeah, it's our part. We can do whatever we want. That's right. So, we better go build a, a secret base so we can hide out for the night. Pee on Are all the ready? trees. Fun Eat all the squirrels. Ready for adventure, Sean Wise. I'll give it up. For a 16-year-old, he is handling the fact that his little brother has superpowers and his dad was shot really well. <laughs> Consider me impressed. Okay. Let's go. Maybe we don't need to go too far into the heart of bear country to build our shelter. Oh, maybe, you know, j just a thought. <laughs> Bears have ears, idiot. Please, please come along. Ooh, Sean. What? Let's play hide and seek. No. Bet you can't find me. Shut, no. Don't, no, no, not right no, now. not right now. Don't hide, bears. Just stick together. Yes. Uh, you're no fun. I know. Not today, I'm not. Where are we Sean. going? Whatever. I think this is the way. Maybe this is the way? I bet nobody knows what they mean anymore. I don't it's know what they mean. Say. It's a square. It doesn't... It tells ooh. us to go straight. It's a tree map. Yes, we've been over this. Look, raccoon. Daniel. We should eat it. Come check this out. What? Delicious little hands. What? Be quiet. One for each of us. We'll take off. 
Ooh, raccoon. Yum. He's so cute. Lure him with the Choco <laughs> Crisp. That raccoon will tear us apart. Let's if go. We tear him apart first. No, no, no. You're scaring away our meal. I'm gonna have to eat you. How could you? God, stop chasing after the, the raccoon. Here, kitty, kitty. Here, kitty, kitty. Aw, that raccoon must be starving. Raccoons are way smarter than us. He'll find more food. What are we doing? What is it doing? What if this raccoon is related to the... Oh, it to probably the is. Food? Hey, don't think about stuff like that. Maybe they were brothers. Like us. Makes me sad. Yes, yeah, and they split up. That's what happens when Just you split up. Uh. Okay, wait. the The sign told us to go straight, right? So we're we're gonna go straight because I think this is a circle. Maybe. Okay, this is still saying go straight. I'm, I'm learning. That showed me how to read these. Hey, there's here. Good. Go straight. Um, uh, maybe Ooh. not. I bet the ants are out here. Yep. I don't. I do not want to get stuck out here. We gotta find a campsite. Well, it won't be here. To find another way around. There was another way around. I thought I was being smart by going straight. Will you get out of the way? I think I know what I'm doing. Kind of. Maybe. I don't know. I'm 16. I was just trying to get my dick wet. Ooh, oh. Sean. What? Look! Look! Yes. I discovered a secret path. You discovered it. Coming. Way to go. Go, go you. Right, right, right behind you. Daniel. Call Daniel. Oh, there he is. Don't run off. You saw what happened. Um. What about is that a bird's these nest? berries? Oh yeah. They're everywhere out here. At least they have a home. They don't have much. Uh, are these the same ones nothing. as before? Come on. We're too big for a nest. Uh, it's just not worth. I don't know. I they kind of look the same. Give them a try. They look the same. They're good. They're good. Come eat all these berries. So we don't want to eat the red ones. We want to eat the purple ones. Learning. Guess who's not going to have diarrhea? Okay, you're missing out, kiddo. That's fine. Nuts to you. So how long until we see a bear? Like, honestly, you think two, maybe three minutes? There's no way we're going through this entire woods without seeing a bear. I don't know why we're going further. What? Oh, hold on. I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming. Hold on. I keep forgetting you're nine. <laughs> and jumping down something like that might be a little bit excessive. Uh, Sean, come on. I'm here. Stop yelling. I got you. Bears have ears. Uh, We've been over this. Uh, phew. Thanks. We gotta climb back up through all of this just to keep walking. What's the point? <laughs> We're not gonna start a new life. No. No. Don't eat mushrooms. Uh, no. You see that? Yeah. Looks like a clicker. Creepy. Yeah. <laughs> Stop it. That's a great reference. I was getting The Last of Us vibes out of this. That does look like a clicker. Well then, look at you. Sean, it's getting really dark. I know. I'm working on it, real. okay? I'm trying to get as far down the river as I can for whatever reason. I'm still not clued into this plan. I would say we could go fishing and try to get some food, but we don't have any fishing gear, so that doesn't really make a whole lot of yeah! sense. <gasps> I got you! Dude, you struck out. That did not scare me. Liar, liar! Uh, I saw your face! That was, uh, surprise. You're lucky I didn't Maybe punch you like that bully kid. One second. <laughs> I got you, I eat you. Don't mess with the zombie. Is this a good place? Oh, I think we found a cave-ish. Looks like a cave. Ish. Kind of, kind of spooky. No. Actually, it's kind of perfect. It's just a rock. How is this a cave? For what? For us, man. We're gonna stay in there? I don't know. Uh, come on, Daniel. Look, this could be our secret base. Hmm. I bet. We could stop any orts from capturing us in here. Cool. In that case, we definitely need to get a fire going first, right? 
Right. I was gonna say I brought yes. my weed pipe, so I should have a lighter, or matches, uh, or something. So what do we need? Wood, uh, shit to make a fire. You protect the base. You protect the base. I need you to build a fort to keep out orcs, trolls, uh, everything, and I'll take care of finding the wood. Deal? Yes. I can build traps too. Nothing will get to us. Awesome, dude. I know. I don't trust him to wander around. Doesn't really understand how bears work. Good. Okay. Let's unpack. We got $33, a weed pipe, beer, chips. Uh, what else? A cell phone that doesn't work. Blankets? We got blankets. Are those traps coming along? No? He's, he's working on it. Oh yeah, we had a bottle of water as well. Coming. I didn't have to look far for wood. There's already wood Let's there, see. apparently. Here's a good spot. You just work away, okay? I'm gonna go look for stuff that would help us. We got moving water. That uh, might be decent to drink. We do have a bottle already. One step here and wham. Good, good. You keep that up. Hey, how you doing, log? Get in my arms. Now this is perfect. Is it though? This seems a tad bit excessive. This is gonna be one hundred percent orc proof. Oh, he's making a fence. <laughs> okay, I might keep the raccoons out or something. Can I not lay this down? I want to help build too. There must be more logs or something over here. Yeah, here we go. Log number two. Nice and dry. Good, good. Log number three. Log number four. Everything is coming up. Millhouse. I don't remember their last name. That's enough for a toasty fire. Oh, that's all we need. Smoky, smoky. I don't see any bears. I think we're in the clear. Good. Okay. How are the uh, traps coming along? I should really just have him sitting down. <laughs> Bears have ears. <laughs> like, he shouldn't be wasting his energy. He's just gonna run around doing all this senseless work when we're in a survival situation. Here. Wood. Hey. Fire. This isn't too bad. I guess Daniel can chill a little. Hey. Can you give me a hand? What? Yeah. Why do you want to move that? That's so much wasted energy. We've been over this. This is the best way to protect the base. Curving. Yo, what are you doing? I'm trying to move this branch to protect the base. Good call. Here, let me take this side. You got it? We'll see. Go ahead and push. To get in here now. Damn right. Unless it's nice like work, two feet tall. Cool. I'll go check the river. I'm curious about these carvings. What does this have to say? 1986. Damn, that's ancient. Hmm. Interesting. Probably been a while since people have been here. Uh, can I start my fire now? Trunk. We're doing okay together. Are we? Are we really? Kids, man. That, that's cute. See, to think I was gonna bang somebody, <laughs> and yet I'm making a secret base in the forest. Uh, okay. Here we go. Fire time. 
Yeah, you see? You still have a penis drawn on your hand. Sean? What? Whoa. Nice view. Don't pull a Lion King. You can see so far. You're a scout. Uh, let's... Eh, you know what's screw it. Wait, I'm coming. We've already eaten quite a bit, right? We've, we've already had uh, berries and... Berries. Almost had a raccoon. You know, but we're doing fine. It's... Beautiful. It's like a Bob Ross painting. Pretty amazing, huh? Mm. See? It's not so bad here in the forest. Hey, look at those clouds. What do they look like to you? I don't know. Cotton candy? That's it? Cotton candy? I don't know. What do you see? A dragon or our babysitter? Andrew. Our babysitter? Where? I swear. Look. There's this gross ponytail. There's this pointy rat face. Oh no. It's so real. <laughs> Andrew sucked. I'm glad we don't need a babysitter anymore. Ooh, I see something else. There's a giant douchebag. Yeah, Andrew. <laughs> oh, yeah. Where? <laughs> right here. <laughs> right here, huh? <laughs> I'm amazed he hasn't asked anything about the whole, you know, kid that was got punched in the face and fell down and like broke his back and the police officer with the gun and like he was there for all of that. Just like a little pre-amnesia and post-amnesia, I guess. And yeah, we need to eat. We need to start a fire. We need to, I don't know, Let's go eat something. make bear traps. We're not going to run into trolls or ogres. Do we even have anything to eat? Just realize we're gonna start a fire and roast what? Our choco crisp? This this might be dumb. Uh ignite. Alright, and I know. We're cave people now. Time to make fire. We make fire. Can I help? Um yeah, you know what? Screw it. Blow. You have a big mouth like me, so come on. Blow. Yes! Dude, don't blow it out. Sorry. Sorry. I wanted to do it like a movie. Oh, nice. It's warming up. I guess it is October, right? It's probably not going to be too warm tonight. We have blankets. We have fire. Everything is under control. For, you know, two kids trying to survive in the woods. In bear country. Wish we had more. We got that Choco Crisp. I know. Go back and get some berries too. Me too. Uh, I'm ready for dessert. <laughs> Go ahead. Mmm. Do you want a piece? Uh, you wasted a lot of energy when you were doing the whole setting up traps and stuff, so I'm good. Uh, I'm good. You eat it. I'm the judge now. I had a beer. Not you. So you can't have a piece anyway. Okay. I wasn't going to get a piece get regardless, was I? Hey, I want a new trial. Too late. Tort closed. 
Mmm. Mmm. So good. Do you inhale it? I wish we had a cheeseburger and a milkshake like yesterday. Yesterday? Did we have that yet? Oh, right. They've been gone for two days. I'm, I'm out of the loop here. So do we want to tell them that yesterday was yesterday or that shake was so good? Uh, let's try to be positive. Oh, dude, that shake was so good. Can't believe we found a diner on the way out here. <laughs> I want another one. I know. We'll get you one. Promise. So maybe I don't have $33. I didn't check my wallet. Uh, can I? I only have $20. We've already spent uh, 13 bucks on milkshakes and hamburgers and stuff. Crap. What's the fire doing? Man, I made a fire tonight. That would be proud. Man, this is the coolest secret base ever. Nobody's gonna find us. Yeah, I mean, it has beer. Nice, Sean. Beers are exactly what we needed for survival. <laughs> oh, yeah, I could have taken sodas. They Look, probably would have been better for surviving. <laughs> it's not quite full yet, wolf boy. Do you think there are werewolves for real? Uh, we are the wolves. Dude, we are the wolves. Ow! See? Ow, ow! Ow, ow, ow! Bears ow. have ow, 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 ears. Ow, 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 ow. I can't stress that enough. Do we have anything else of interest? Chips, our phone that doesn't work, the lighter that we already used. I could really use a smoke. Could you? Your 16 year old lungs really need that right about now. Well, it doesn't have much. Backpack doesn't have much. Okay, what do you got to say? Let's check on him. You okay, buddy? Yeah. Feels good to sit down. Sean? Are you mad at me for what happened with Brett? Yeah. I don't remember everything. Obviously. Um. Oh, geez. Do I want to tell him? Uh. I should probably. Tell him. We got in a fight. Did you kick his ass? Yeah. Actually, I did, but yeah. What do you want? It's not like the movies, Daniel. Uh, I'm so tired. What is that noise? It sounds like walking. What the hell is that? It sounds like it's coming from right there and it's freaking me out. Okay, go, go get uh, some sleep. You look tired. Ready to crash? I've been ready all day. My feet hurt. I think we earned some serious rest. I could sleep forever. Not on this ground. <sighs> better than freezing out there, right? Way better. Now we have a real fire. And a secure base. You did awesome today, Daniel. Really? Hell yeah. Without you, there's no fellowship. Um, that's cool. My eyes won't stay open, son. Sleep tight, bro. I keep expecting to see, like, a bear silhouette pop its head up and be like, Hmm, don't mind if I do. Oh. It didn't skip to morning. That's not good. Whoa.
Oh shit. Is he having a wind nightmare? Oh crap. No, no. Please no exploding. No exploding during nightmares, young man. Dad, where are we? Wake him up now. Daniel? He's gonna drop that rock hey, on bro. you guys. Wake up. It's okay. You, you just had a bad dream. That's all. Sh Sean? Where... Where are we? Right here. In the park. Remember our amazing fire? Um... Yeah? Are we okay? Uh... You fortified our base, so we're perfect. Mm, I did. You're right. His memory doesn't seem too good. Oh, go back to sleep. You need your rest. But I might have another scary dream. When he exploded, did he hit his head or something? I, I guess here. he was technically knocked out. Just, just close your eyes. Thanks, Sean. I'm glad you're here. Good night, Daniel. Hopefully he remembers everything tomorrow. I don't need a little concussed boy. State Route 7, Washington, the next day. So we made our way out of the park and now we're on another road, I guess. Look, it's easier now. We're going down here. We just gotta keep walking. Uh, yeah, that's better. Hey, maybe we'll find a milkshake shop. Ah, oh, yes. The four secret milkshake factory. <laughs> keep dreaming, dude. Let's walk a little more. There will be a rest stop or something where we can buy food. I'm sure of it. Why are we out oh. here? Remember that time? Harry Thompson wanted to beat me up. Me and Noah traded some games with Harry. But he didn't like us, so he said he was gonna get us after school. What did you do? We waited in the gym until he went home. That's it? You should have told me. I tried. But you said to get out of your room. Oh, I'm sorry. <sighs> I'm sorry, you know, no. I should have listened. You did stand up for me. With Brett. For a change. Yeah. Well, he had it coming. Yeah. Is this some hey, kind of hunger induced illusion? Ahead. Yep. Must be the gas station we saw on that sign. This is better than. Oh, and I got phone service! Finally! Um, let's see what's going on. Oh, come on! I didn't even get a chance to read anything! Shit, my phone's dead. Yeah, maybe we can charge it in here. I'm so hungry for real food right now. I hear you. But chips and berries aren't real food? We're gonna get food, water, and plus a map. So we can find the best route. Money in your backpack. I got $20.30. See what All we right. can make happen here. Hey, come on. I know last night was tough, but tonight will be better. What do these people I have swear. to say? Yeah. Utah. You're a long way from home, dude. Steal anything from them? How can someone drive with this mess? Interesting. It's strange that we'll be able to look at this. It sucks I can't do Halloween at home. It's dad. Oh yeah, is today Halloween? Maybe tomorrow? We're definitely getting there. Hello, random family! Send Daniel to beg. Wonder what they're doing here. Maybe they got some extra food. I guess we can even check my goddamn voicemail here. Speak to them first. Um. Hey. Hi. Uh oh. Here it comes. Oh hi there. It's very little food. Nice weather. Visiting. Happy Halloween. Hey. Happy Halloween. My brother's a zombie. Don't you have a costume? Nah. -uh. I'm 11 years old. Halloween is for kids. Oh, my brother loves it. I don't. I'm almost 12. 
You said you were 12. Kids always want to be adults. If only they knew. So, how old are you? Uh, he's nine. I'm almost ten. Oh, you can talk. <laughs> yeah, he can talk. A lot. Whatever. Why would he not be able to talk? Um... I don't like them. Uh, I hate to ask, but... Uh, we forgot to get money before coming here, so... Could you spare a little food? Or something? Do you mind? We're kind of busy. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. We'd like to help, but... I thought we left Berkeley to get away from this. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, hey, no worries. It's cool. Didn't mean to bug you. Bye. Come on. Let's go. Hmm. I want Coco. Oh, and now we can't send Daniel. Honey, Damn. This is a gas station. Anything in here? There might be some leftovers in it. Well, look, well, well, I suppose. Ah, oh, crap. Don't want to freak them out. Let me get rid of these idiots Daddy, first. I'm cold. I mean, I could spend some of my own money, but I don't really want to. Um. Better clean up before we look like the gutter punks downtown. Yeah, it's hey. probably a good idea before we go in the store. Come on in. Let's wash a little. Ugh, I'm coming. Makes sense. A uh, little bottle. Nice. Let's please. Free water, please. Fill up the old inventory. I know. So wash fast. Ugh, my hands are ice cubes. Okay, you're done. That's an improvement. Uh, toilet paper dispenser is a bear. Stop watching me, perv. Just stares at your crotch as you go. Do we need to use the bathroom? Are we good to go, or? Do you need to... Ma, it's okay. I went in the woods just before we got here. Cool. Bathroom note. You don't flush. We call it cops. <laughs> okay, then. They they seem like lovely people. Yeah, I can't wait to go in and try to buy something from them. Oh, there's a mirror here. Anything of use? Oh, shit. My face. You look older, dude. Sure you feel older. Okay. Well, I guess that went well-ish. They're still here. Damn. Kinda hoping they had buggered off. Can I speak to them again? Nah, I don't really want to, to be completely honest. Maybe I can screw with their car? Anything of interest here or steal from them? California plates. Maybe they can help us. Are we trying to go to California? Who's... I don't, I don't think they were from California. Hmm. Let's see if there's anybody in here. Last night was so cold. I don't even want to think about ice. It's cool we found this place. Okay. Uh, there's something over there. Bugs barred off. Wildlife poster. A bunch of posters. Spanish lessons. Nachos and cerveza? You sound like an expert douchebag. Yeah. Hey, look. They're gonna teach us Spanish. Este tipo es un idiota. I figured we speak Spanish. I hope they're nice. They're probably not. Hello there. Oh, uh. Hey. Beware the Halloween witch. Maybe she is nice. Prove me wrong, then. Hmm. Never heard of that team. Okay. Keep that in mind. You never know when you're going to need something. Play for a dollar. Uh, I should probably be saving my dollars. I don't think that's a good idea. Oh, my God. This is the coolest thing ever. No, no, no. Uh, steal? Hey, come here. Or add Check to our out. basket? Uh, I don't really want to steal. Seems like a bad idea. Seems like the kind of thing you get caught oh, for doing. Man. That is so cool. Oh. 
can't believe how lost we are. Hey, hey, how are you doing? I know what you're thinking. What the hell is this creep looking at? Yeah. Uh, no, I don't mean... No, I was thinking I mean, that. I'm very concerned. It seems, though. These people, they only want to live a normal life. Just naked. Oh, it's a nudist I mean, thing. If they're not harming anyone, who's to say they're wrong? Nobody. Yeah, I agree. Yes, why should we all be the same? Who says so? <laughs> Never mind. Uh, I'm getting carried away. Name's Brody. I'm kind of an online traveling journalist. Sean. What's a online traveling journalist? Just a fancy name for someone who drives around in a car, writing about people and stuff. There's a few websites that pay me for these papers since I know how to write. Nice to meet you, man. You traveling with your brother? Our dad's with us. Our dad's Can with us. You? We're going south. Good for you. The best way to learn is on the road. The earlier, the better. Well, I'd love to talk and avoid work all day, but I'm already up against a deadline. Safe travels, dudes. Thanks, man. See you around. I know it said that his license plate might be able to help us, but I I just don't trust him. It's going to be freezing tonight, so we need to stock up. We get Choco Crisp for $1.99. We can get two hot dogs for $6. I think there's a bunch of stuff here that we can buy. Mac and cheese, $4.50. A tent, $69.99. What are the, oh my God, there's so much stuff here. Sleeping bags? <laughs> Camping dishes? Why the fuck not? Shit. We could just camp out in here. T-shirts, sweaters, family soon. knives. I need all of this. Pretty sweet. What can I do to get the old broad out of here so that I can steal everything? Hi. What are you looking at? That's an option. Hey there. Well, Seriously, who's buying all these wooden bears? Stay away from oh, Bar Brody. Do don't don't talk to him. Bears. Like stuff? Buy one get one yeah. free. It's, uh, uh, yeah. Stuff. We're not from around here. Get over it. I know these kind of things. Is there any way to get rid of her? Let's yeah, talk to sure her. You. Hey. Hi. Good evening. Yes. Can I help you? You don't look like you're from around here. Is anybody? Um, we live out here. We're camping. We're on a road trip. Uh, we're camping. Uh, we're camping. Yeah? Where? I... I can't remember the name. It's not far. Looks like you went through a mud flow. Oh, uh, we went on a big hike and fell. A lot. So where are your parents? Uh, with our friends, with our dad, no parents allowed. Uh, where are your parents? Where are your parents with our dad? With our friends. Uh oh, we're with our friends. Pretty fun. By yourselves, all the way out here? Come here all the time or short short field trip. Oh, it's no big deal. Um, just a short field trip. We're not that far from home. Well, didn't mean to grill you. Just making sure you're okay out here. Have a nice day. Damn it! Should I have made her realize that we're in trouble and maybe she would have given me a discount or something? Ooh, Sean, At least she seems out. okay. It's boring. It's Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, uh, local map. Go on. It's actually free. Cool. Thanks. It's a real nice map. You'll find lots of great hiking trails around here. It'll come in handy. See the baby bear, Daniel? Oh, that is awesome, possum. I mean, the bear. So cool. Then he's all yours. We have a surplus, as you can tell. Really? Oh, oh, she is nice. You. Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't steal from her. Oh, uh, a new souvenir. Oh, don't I feel like a bit of a dick. What about that? She's staring at you. We can use that. 
Yeah, listen, man, trust me. I would love all this camping gear, but... Um, what's that? No way we can get this. We could live in that. Yeah, but... but there's I... no way we can pay for it. There's no way I can steal it. Oh, she does have a puppy. Look, it's a puppy. What? Can I steal you? Yeah, it's a dog. Oh, a puppy. Sure. Super cute doggy. You ready? Is this yours? Somebody left her down the road. If I saw who did that, it'd be the last time. Aww. So it can be mine. Be sad. What's his name? Her. Whoever takes her gets to name her. Oh. We want right. her. Maybe. Can we have the puppy? Please? Oh shit, I don't know. Um uh -huh. we, we would have to carry it and I would have to I mean, let me think about it. Let me think. I don't know. It's a pretty huge responsibility. Yeah. It would be so cool. Come on. Oh, honey. We have to have an adult take care of her. Thank you. I know. My decision easier. I thought we could. I'd love to. But she's right. I already have to take care of you. We can't take care of the dog right now. Crap. I, I really want to try to steal cards. something, but it's, just, it's clearly not going to work. There's no way I'm just going to put a tent in my backpack and get out of here. Um, no more food. I'm There's gotta be stuff here for us. I'm sliced done. bread. So what exactly are you doing uh, all the way out here? Soda. Water bottles. Sounds intriguing. Well, I already have water. Oh god, this is this is a crap decision. I got another choco crisp bar. I got mac and cheese, and we're gonna get two hot dogs, and that should leave us with a little bit of money left over, because we're gonna need money I left over. This will be the meal for now. Mac and cheese will be the meal for later. Sound reasonable? I don't even have a can opener. I can't put this back, can I? Nope, nope, we made them. Okay, time to check out. Maybe she'll... It's a discount or something? I don't know. Looks like you're all set to go. Is that it? Yeah. I think so. Okie dokie. Let's ring you up. And there's the damage. They get a tent. Twelve forty-nine. Uh, I have twenty dollars. I'll leave me with seven or eight bucks. Fine. I think that's it. Okie dokie. Thanks much. All right. Here's your change. Cool. Thanks. Did we want? Oh, thank you, Doris. I didn't realize what your name was. Uh. I don't suppose you'd be willing to give me money or something like that. You don't mind me hogging the table. No. Useless. Great. Maybe we can get rid of those people outside? That'd be really helpful. Just shoo them away. Oh, they're leaving! We can check the garbage now. Hey look! Empty table! Oh, let's grab it. Yeah. And check out this map. We have our hot dogs. And we can check the newspapers. Hold on. If there's anything of interest here, because, you know, kids exploding. Oh, shit, they're still looking for us. We Ooh. can't go back. Ignites protest. Let's say... Even it's just scribbles. Please search for suspects Sean and Daniel Diaz. Diaz, good to know. Can't let Daniel know. Yeah, we're on Not the front right page now. of the newspaper. Which is surprising that nobody noticed. I guess they're not big newspaper readers. Very good. Uh, let's just check this uh, trash can. Anything? They probably left a whole bunch behind, right? Yay. A fucking half-eaten apple. Uh, keep it. Well, if we don't eat it, nobody will. Stocking up. Okay, there we go. Let's uh, eat and study the map. It's our table now. <laughs> yep. Let's see. What do we got here? This is a ton of food. I thought we were broke. Not today, Daniel. So let's grub out. This is our choco. Really? You got me a choco crisp? You're welcome. You that must be the, the husband, Doris's husband. 
Maybe he's cool. Hey, Brody. Where are you guys off to now? Uh, south, I guess. Right on. Pro tip, don't feed the bears. <laughs> See you later. Whoa, that's a big map. So maybe he yeah, wasn't weird. Hope I can read it. I thought he would try to abduct us or something. Is this supposed to be Washington? I don't recognize anything. Yeah, me neither. But we have to be somewhere in there. Hey, I know. We're here. There's a gas station. See? Nah, no way. We were near Mount Rainier yesterday. But it's miles away now. Let me show you where we are, okay? Yeah, okay. Oh, we slept at that trout trail thing. Then we walked south for a while. Ooh, um... So, are you gonna show me? I'm, I'm working on it. We slept at that trout trail thing. Yeah. So then that we was walked south for a while. here, and then walk south. Uh, we should be here, shouldn't we? Right? I think that's right. All right. This is it. Are you sure? <sighs> yes, it is. It's next to the river we camped by yesterday. Here we are. Okay, so can we go there tonight? Are you kidding? It's way too far. You want to walk a whole week again? It's like three <sighs> days. But it looks cool. Hold on. I'll find where we can go. Um. Hey, kids. Looks like you're out camping. Oh, hey. Oh, yeah. Just going over trails and stuff. Seems dangerous to be out here all alone. But maybe you're the ones who need to be watched. Huh? What do you mean? We sure just hope you pay for all that. Of course I did. Tolerate shoplifters. Uh, sir, we paid for this, and the map was free. Well, let's go inside. You can show us what you bought. Uh, no, thanks. We have to go. But I didn't nope. steal anything. You're going inside. Don't make this worse for yourself, kid. Or I will. Oh, Doris is gonna get pissy with you. Flee, attack, or discuss. I mean, we, we didn't steal anything. We paid for everything. Doris was cool. So maybe she'll apologize and give us something else. Uh, yeah, let's discuss it. Uh, excuse us, sir. We were just hiking, I swear. Then let's find out if you're telling the truth. Come on. Uh, but we have to get going. Sean? Uh, it, it's okay. Look, our our dad is waiting for us. Okay. You can call him from our phone. Now let's go. Don't touch me. Don't do it, boy. Let go. Uh, Don't touch my brother. Okay. What the shit is your problem? I really hope Doris is gonna feel bad about this now. Hi, Officer Bowell. It's Hank. Hank Stamper. Listen, I caught myself a couple of fugitives you might be interested in. Ah. Oh, they ain't going anywhere. Don't you worry. Okay, fine. What now, I wish I had stolen everything. Where am I? Oh shit. Daniel. No, no, no. Don't do this to me. Police will get those two straightened out. Are you sure about this, Hank? I don't know. Then they'll be off our property and won't be our problem no more. If you say so, then... How were we your problem? We were paying customers. Let you deal with it. Doris, you rat. Oh. Hey there. You finally awake? Sorry I had to secure you. But if you're innocent, don't act guilty. How's your stomach? You kidnapped me. I'm gonna tell the police you kidnapped me. Nice try, but I know who you are and what you did in Seattle. I saw it in the paper. 
Maybe I should call ICE to make sure you're a citizen. Fuck you, hillbilly. I'm American. <clears throat> Watch it, punk. Whatever. I'm going to jail for this. Pretty sure the local police will vouch for me over a thug like you. Where's my brother? Wish I knew. Little shit took off. I'll find him. Don't worry. If you touch him... You think I'd hurt a little boy? Guess you didn't have any second thoughts about leading him out into the middle of nowhere, though. That's real safe for a little kid. If he's lucky, he won't end up like his criminal big brother. Just let me go. Please. You're the reason we need to build that wall. You hold tight. I'm gonna go get your brother. 2016, man. Uh, can we break this now? Come on. It's only plastic. Anything else of interest? Window. Daniel must be scared shitless. Is it raining out? I can't leave him out there. Cuter store. Okay. Looks like he's gone for now. Wonder if I could get more light from it. Okay. Airboard tube. There to push. Wake up the computer. Good. Yes. That's a little better. Got a minute or two now. Um anything else in the storage room. Can I get in there? I can't see anything. Open. Yeah, that's what I thought. Fuck. Locked. Crap. Crap crap crap. Uh only picture. Yeah, we get it. You're the perfect Americans. Thing back there. Ooh, I hear you. Shush, 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 boy. Working. Working on things. Uh, I'll, I'll answer him. Shit. Answer him. Okay, hold on, hold on. Why we'll answer you, Daniel? I'm right here. Are are you okay? I, I, I think so. That old guy chased me into the woods. But I, I think I lost him. Is he gone? I'm really, really scared. <laughs> hey, Inano. You're doing great. You totally fooled them. Thanks to you, we have a chance of getting out of here. Yeah? Yeah. We gotta hurry, though. He called the cops on us. Think, dude. There's gotta be a way out of here. I love papers. I don't even want to think of this asshole reading the same magazines as Dad. Oh yeah. This racist shithead is a real pillar of the community, all right. The Honorable Ernest Shack, Deputy Mayor, dear Mr. Hank Stamper, on behalf of our Commerce Bureau, we're proud to present you our model. Si okay, I don't even care, even a little tiny bit. Did I say 822? Oh. I'm sorry, but you married an asshole. Hank and Doris. Yeah, okay. Um, can you can tear you this try up? and open this vent? Yes. Not seeing anything to help me down here, bud. Ouch. It hurts. Sorry, Sean. Don't, Don't worry. We'll figure something out. Man, man this is heavy. Um, this window, can you open the back door? Hey, you think you can open the back door? I don't know. Be a bad idea. Might be a bad idea. No, locked. Locked. Coming back around to say it through this. It, it won't open. It's locked. What do I do? I don't know. Window? Let window. Me think. There's a window over there. Maybe you can find a way in or something. Not seeing anything around me that would help. You can do it a neon sign. It is. Be careful. It might attract him. Yeah, I would say. Oh, keys. Of 
course the fucking keys are all the way over there. Could really use a little raccoon friend right about now. Pipe anchor. Um Can I get rid of this pipe anchor somehow? Can I do something about the pipe anchor? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, here we go. Tear. Right. Okay, Daniel. I see some keys, but I can't reach them. <sighs> Maybe I can get them if I can pry this pipe off the wall. Can you find some kind of tool out there? I don't know where one is. Find me something sturdy, like a... A screwdriver or a wrench. Anything. But where can I find one? Uh and I know I can't really see much from where I am. There should be some tools nearby. Okay, okay, I'm yeah, there should be. There there have to be tools nearby. I mean everywhere has tools, right? Uh I guess I'm just gonna keep shimmying around. Really no way for me to tear this off. Found something. Oh, fuck. That dude's gonna come back. Why did I put us in this situation? I found something. What am I gonna do? What did you find? Is this what you wanted? This is it. You rule, Daniel. Good we'll job done. Okay. Tear you. Come on. Let's do this. Okay. Uh, mash. I'm gonna mash. Mash away. Mash. I was yes. worried about bears. Good job, bro. Racist hillbillies. Get out of the way, couch. What am I doing now? What? 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 Stop! Stop doing things. Oh, there we go. It's not giving me any direction. Yeah. Just keep sliding on up. Follow the pipe. There we go. Making progress. Sean, I'm really scared. It's cool, dude. Don't worry about it. We're almost there. Come on, you mother. Yes. Score. Good. Pick up keys. Pick up keys. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Did you do it? Here, here. Come on. Oh, they were the keys. Um, I thought they were the keys to my yes. handcuffs. I'm not handcuffed. Sean. I'm zip tied. Oh God, I was so scared. This is not good. What happened to your face? That old bastard happened. Okay, we need to cut this off fast. Scissors. Yes, yeah, scissors will do. Dude, good idea. You rock. Did that asshole see you? No way. I'm invisible. Yeah, you are. Okay. Now we gotta get my stuff and go. Oh, not again. Oh. Damn. What? What happened? Goods. He what? super powered it. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what happened. Screw him. Take everything. It's okay. You're safe now. Good, I hope he's dead. <laughs> now, we can steal camping gear or we can leave. Oh, would stealing camping gear get me in trouble? Like, would I take too much time and somebody might show up? Kinda wanna steal some camping gear. Risk it for the biscuit, we're gonna steal a whole bunch of camping gear. You fucking little spick. Oh, kick him. You and your brother are going to jail for the rest of your life. Maybe we should've left. Uh, maybe we should assault him? Knock out and steal. Yeah, I'm fine with that. I told you to leave us alone! Sean! What are you doing? Daniel, come on. We gotta get out of here. See, now we've technically broken the law, whereas come before on. we didn't. Wait. But at the same time, they were never gonna believe us. Shit! And it feels good to kick that guy in the head. I regret nothing. Where are we going? We're gonna go set up our tent. Sean! Watch out! Over there. Let's go. I don't know. Isn't that Brody's car? 
is nice. He's got the creepy vibe to him. Fingers crossed we didn't get abducted. I guess it's better than getting arrested. Kind of. Not really. Oh, the stress. That camping gear is kind of unnecessary now that we're in a car. having a shitty day. I knew that guy was sketchy. Did he mess with you? Total fucking dickhead. What did he freak out? Why did he freak out? Yeah, did he mess with you? Did he mess with you too? He started too earlier, but I bought too much stuff just to piss him off. Welcome to Redneck Land. The Saint Seattle no more. More Bigfoots than Mexicans. Yeah. My dad said there are more Bigfoots out here than Mexicans. No doubt. People out here are more scared of you and your little brother. This is nuts. Well, don't let it phase you, little dude. You're going to meet some amazing people on the road, too. <coughs> you stole the, the dog blanket? instead of the camping gear. Come on, I'm not stupid. I would be mad, but I'm kind of not. Daniel. What? We <laughs> saved her. We're heroes. <laughs> oh, we can't keep a dog. Are you kidding me? We can't keep a dog. But you said that maybe we could. <laughs> Don't give up, Daniel. He's on the ropes. Jeez, come on. We need a dog. Bet Dad would agree. Just, just stop. You win, but you better really take care of her. Deal. Thanks, Sean. She's gonna be so quiet. And, and, and what should we name her? Now, don't hey, get me wrong. Your dog. I love her. Your choice. But oh, if we cool. have to eat her, we could. Let's see. Um. Mm, how about? How about bear? Mushroom. She totally looks like a mushroom. That's that's not even a name. <laughs> Come on. That's not even a name, dude. But I love mushroom. And you said it was my choice. Okay, okay. You win. <laughs> but this one's on you. Ooh, yeah. Thanks, big brother. See, mushroom, you got the best name ever now. <laughs> Mushroom. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I feel like I just witnessed history. You're on your way to becoming official road warriors, my dudes. <laughs> on the road for a long time, what do you do exactly? So, I know we asked him, but I'm curious if he's changed exactly? his story at all. Long, boring story short. I come from a family with money, but no soul. I took off after school and never looked back. Now I write stories for zines and websites, do podcasts, protest, try to make some positive change. Whatever. Wow. Okay. So like all political. Everything is political, Sean. Are you famous? You ever get lonely? Or how do you make money? 
Uh, see, I kind of want to know that. Man, that sounds cool. Don't you ever get kind of lonely? Uh, there's a big difference between alone and lonely. Yeah. And you probably meet a lot of people out here. That's right. The unseen side of America. Hmm. Hey, no matter what, I just try not to get cynical. Otherwise, uh... I'd be like my family. End of the day, we have to watch out for each other, right? Yeah, you did watch out for us. Thank you. Seriously. <laughs> Looks like your brother crashed hard. Oh, good. He always goes right to sleep in cars. Yeah, and feel free to do the same. I won't take it personally. What about you? You okay to drive? Oh, yeah. This is my favorite time to drive. Traveling by night is kind of mysterious. Still don't have a good feeling. I mean, he's nice, but people are really rarely nice in games. North Oregon coast, three hours later. Look at that. Oregon is like the edge of the world. Hmm. Hey, listen. I know what happened with you guys in Seattle. Do you want to talk about it? I'm a good listener. It's your call. No pressure. I... I don't even know what happened. It was so fast. Uh, it was the police. It was the police. It's their fault. Dano just wanted to play zombie outside. Our shithead neighbor was picking on him. And I got in a fight. So dad came out to help. Somebody called the cops and... And they shot him. They killed my dad in front of me. One second my dad was alive. Then... Then... Fucking cops. Hey, it's gonna be alright. Take a deep breath. Listen, I'm really sorry this happened to you, man. Injustice is everywhere. And you're taking the brunt of it right now. But you're gonna be okay, Sean. How? How? My life feels like... Like that town down there. Wiped out. Destroyed. Empty. Is that like Arcadia Bay? What is sure is that's the past. But you can't look back now. You've got each other. And you have to move forward. 
Why? You may not see it, but what you and your brother have is the most important thing. He needs you. And you need him. I can tell he doesn't know what happened. Sean, at some point, you're gonna have to tell him. I know. I just have to find the right time. Take it from me. The sooner you can address it, the better. Yeah. I'm gonna do it next chance I get. It's just... It's not gonna be easy. So then, what's your plan? Where are you going? Yes, Good question. Please fill us in. I was thinking, get out of the country, fuck it, go down to Mexico, you know? <laughs> Damn, I thought I was the long haul traveler. Should I go back or should we keep going? I wish we shouldn't go back. <sighs> Maybe this is crazy, but should we just keep going till we get to Mexico? If you think that's the right thing to do, yes. This is exactly what you're supposed to be doing. You have family there? Maybe. We don't even have family in the US. Except for grandparents we don't see anymore. What about your mom? No, no way. She's out of the picture. But dad, he always talked about this plot of land he owns in this little coast town, Puerto Los. That's a pretty cool name. So it's gotta be great. Okay, so you've still got a long ways to go. We've shot the shit long enough. Time to hit the road. I'm pretty sure for all the souls lost in the Arcadia Bay storm, October 11, 2013. I'll drop you by a motel in a couple of hours. You guys could use some time to yourselves. It asked me when I started the game, have you played Life is Strange 1? And if so, did you sacrifice Arcadia Bay? And I said yes, because that's what I did in the first game. Spoiler warning if you want to go back and watch that. But that would be why we get to see it. Pacific Harbor, Oregon, two hours later. Okay, Mushroom, you can chase me. Then, Sean. <laughs> um, no. Come, see if you can catch me. Ow! <laughs> so, what do we do now? Play fetch, build a sandcastle. Brody's car. Wouldn't mind investigating so Brody's Brody car a little bit. If it wasn't for him, we. I don't know. I'm, I'm. I'm never gonna trust Brody. I'm just gonna say it right now. I would love to be able to charge my phone, but I guess we're just kind of forced into playing hey, fetch. Let's play fetch with the pup. Really? Yes. Or you know, a test throw first. Sleep. Cool. Well, it's the middle of the night. Okay, but I'm next. Okay, puppy. Go wide. Uh, let's not throw it into the grass. I don't want Come to on, lose mushroom. it. Get it! Go, mushroom. We'll figure it out. There we go. Um. Yeah. Oh well. I don't think that's the stick that I <laughs> threw, but sure. Yeah, close Did enough. Frisbee. Now she wants me to throw the stick. Sure. Okay, here. <laughs> Watch how fast she'll get the stick. You go for it. Don't Just throw, don't it, throw it, it too in far. the ocean. I, I swear. I mean, I promise. Come on, mushroom. Come on. Look, it's a stick. Fetch. 
The last thing I need to do is dive into the ocean after a dog. Come on, Mushroom. Get that stick. Looks like these two are getting along. Such a dumpy little it's dog. Good to see him like that. Well, I got you that room. Seriously? I... It's only a room. No big deal. Look, I had tough times when I started out. And some strangers saved my life. Thank you. Now's my turn to help someone. It's right there, room 10. On the second floor. Listen, I don't want to freak you out, okay? But you have to be twice as careful now. I know it's easier said than done, but you should get rid of that phone. Really? Really? You can always get a burner later. Trust me. Wish I had that backup. Sean, talk to Daniel. He deserves Brody, to... You're not leaving, are you? Yes, I am, but not until Santa Brody gives you a goodbye gift. Ta-da! I, I mean... Ho, ho, ho. And don't you dare argue about it. I'll leave it right here if you do. Okay. You win. Thanks, Brody. Maybe I'll trust Brody. Feels good. Here. Looks like it's yours now. As always. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't forget you. I've had it since my first road trip. And it's always kept me safe. Now it's yours. Cool. Um, do you think it's okay if she wears it? Like, our official guard dog? <laughs> sure. It's your bandana now. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Time for me to hit the road again. Hey, don't look so sad. You can contact me on my blog, A Tribe Called West. So, you better keep me posted when you can, okay? We will. Thanks again, Brody. <laughs> ah, bro hug. <laughs> Wish you could stay with us. Me too, kid. <sighs> Sorry, I'll probably think of a better goodbye when I'm on the road, but until then, take care, my dudes. I'm gonna miss him. Me too. He's just gonna drive away and not even molest us? I'm really paranoid when it comes to these games, okay? Okay. Time to hit the sack. A whole lot of generosity from a grown man to a couple of kids, but... There are good people out there still. Don't worry, Mushroom. I got you. This is spooky. Uh, new item added to your inventory. What did we get? Uh, AF oh, it was like a Brody souvenir. It's definitely Brody's. He must have forgotten it when he passed the backpack on to me. Oh, it's like a little sleeping mask. Interesting. And then we also have an Brody's letter. Brody left that letter in the backpack. He sounds really worried for us. Sean, I'm a better writer than I am a speaker. That's why I'm writing this letter while you and Daniel are asleep in the car. I'm sorry that I can't take you further, but there's a good reason for it. As dysfunctional as it can be, family is family. When we met, I was on my way to Utah, where my mom is currently losing her battle against cancer, and I have to be there. You'll find a few dollars in the backpack. That's all the cash I have left, but you need it more than me. Your goal is good, and you need to follow your instinct, but please be careful and protect your brother no matter what. You'll see when you tell him the truth about Seattle that sharing the same pain will make you stronger together, eventually. When you get to Mexico, keep a low profile until you meet people you can truly rely on. In any case, I think you'll be safer there than you are here. A dead cop in the current state of things cannot be a good way to start negotiations. Wish I could have met you two under better circumstances, but I'm glad I could help you the best way I could. Take care, Brody. P.S. Hit me up when you're safe. A tribe called West. I'm always online when not driving. Been a while since I've used a pen. Hope you can decipher. 
fortunately, I have the game do that for me. Okay, then. I guess we just need to go up to our room? Maybe? This is okay. sketchy. Good. Looks like the manager's asleep for the night. I shouldn't have any trouble from them. Probably not. Just any other potential patrons, Do I suppose. Do you think people have Netflix or a jacuzzi? Dude, this is some hotel, not an Airbnb. If you're lucky, it'll have cable and a hot shower. Change. Uh, eight. Nine. Ten. Here we go. Good. I'm gonna throw you in, cave boy. We can watch TV, too. And there's a balcony. Whoa, this is nice. And warm. Oh, this bed is soft. What about this one? Uh, not bad. But too far from the TV. Can I take the one in front of the TV? Huh? Wanna play it over rock, paper, scissors? Oh, there's no way you can beat me, bud. Ready? I am so ready to beat you. He looks like a rock kid. We're throwing paper. Aw, shit. Called it. I told you, man. Can we play another round? Come on. He's gonna throw scissors? Sure, I mean, you're gonna lose again, but suit yourself. Not this time. We're going to throw a rock. I won! <laughs> the pet is mine! I knew I'd beat you. See? And I knew you'd brag about it. Don't be salty. It's a fair win. Yeah, it is. I surrender. All right. I'm going to run a bath. We totally reek. Especially you, Pig Pen. I wouldn't be so short, <laughs> Cave Boy. Same cute little I'll characters from the first Life is Strange. Uh, I'll be right here. Of course you will. Oh, cool! Hot dog man is on. Phone is charging, even oh, though he told me to get rid I of it. This episode. Thanks for everything, Brody. Well, that's the I'll note that he left. Careful. Me. Yeah, Super careful. Uh, we got the tent. Oh shit, that was wild. But okay. We have a tent now. Good, good. So he didn't just steal the dog. Man, wish we still had Brody around. Okay, so we need to run a bath for Daniel. Current objective. Anything else of interest in there? Just a TV. Uh, yeah, hey, lower it. Can you turn that down, please? Yeah, we don't want to get complaints or anything. Draw attention to us. Um, we maybe quiet the dog down as well. Old toy. Yeah, what's that? What's that? It was in Brody's car. He gave it to you. Uh, well, uh, yeah. You stole from you Brody? You stole it from him? I don't know. It looked cool, and you stole before, so I thought... Stealing is bad. <sighs> no, man. Stealing is bad. We only do it if we really need it. Okay? Plus... Brody was super nice with us. If it's bad, then why did you do it? Hey, we had to. It, it was different. I don't want you stealing around, understand? Yeah. Okay. Watch TV together, but I don't really want to do that. I would rather run the bath. Turn that on. And... Uh, Engage back. Fill her up. Better than a river. Bubble bath. Yeah, sure. Why not? Daniel will love this. Doing our best to keep him happy. Uh, let's 
clean ourselves up too. <sighs> Damn. That fucking redneck hit me hard. I hit him harder though. It's bath time. You ready? Aw, the episode's almost finished. Nice try. The water's hot. Come on. Yeah, okay, I'm going. You can take Mushroom with you? Oh my god. Whoa. So many bubbles. Try and keep them in the bathtub. I will. Promise. Thanks. And no, the dog is not taking the bath with you. Okay, okay. Don't worry. I should throw my phone away while Daniel is washing. Should we? He'd freak out if he saw me. I thought we were going to charge it and use it. Wouldn't that be so much better? Time to say goodbye to modern life. It's a friend or something like that? You never know when you're going to need a phone. Not like they're going to track you. Brody with his stupid ideas. <sighs> Shit. Lila's freaking out. Maybe I should leave her out of this. Or she'll get into trouble, too. Ooh. Ooh. I don't think we should tell her anything. We're, we're not going to call her. That's just a risk. Not worth it. There's nothing she could do to help us now. There's, there's only negatives from that decision. Daniel, uh, come here. We need to talk. Can we get a drink first? I'm thirsty. Right now? You said I could have a coat. Or something. Okay, I'll get you a soda. But when I come back, we're going to talk. Serious. Fine. What's the big deal? This is super sketchy. Don't like this. Don't like this even a little bit. Watching the news. Oh shit. Oh god. It was an accident. I fucked up and a cop shot him. No. No. It's not true. 
I'm so sorry. Why? Why did you lie to me? I was scared, Daniel. I didn't know what to say. He should have told me. I couldn't believe it either. I didn't mean to. It's not fair. Hey, come on. I'm here. It's okay. No, it's not. We want to talk about what just happened in the room. Told me we were gonna see Dad. I'm sorry. I just. Just don't lie to me ever again. Ever. I promise I won't lie to you again. I promise. I'm serious, Sean. I know. Me too, Danny. What are we going to do without him? Shh. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Am I a monster? Nothing is wrong with you. You're different. Okay. What are we going to do now? I was thinking. Maybe we could go to Puerto Lobos. Where dad grew up, you know? Yeah, I guess. It'll be fine, Daniel. There's nothing we can't do. As long as we're together. Can you tell me a story? Like he did? I'm not as good as him. He used to tell me bedtime stories, too. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home there with their papa wolf. Three wolves now. Don't forget they mushroom. Lived happily together.
that would be episode one of what I assume will be five. All right. Come on, man. Focus. Okay. Trust me. You can do it. You know what, I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Life is Strange 2, guys. And it's like I said, going into this, I was a little bit hesitant. You know, I really didn't want this to be like the prequel and just kind of fall flat for me, but it had a really compelling story. Like, I'm already invested in these characters and what could possibly happen in the journey that they're gonna go on. And it's a little bit political, which I was pleasantly surprised to see, you know? It's a little bit interesting and plays on the Current situation in America, I guess you could say. And it has the supernatural, which always uh, is just a big plus for me. So, you know what? I think I want to play more. If you guys are interested in seeing more, as always, be sure to leave a like on this video, let me know, and uh, maybe I'll return for episode two whenever it's released. I think you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Peace.